guys, it's JJ and this is Today with JJ. As you see by the title of the video, this is 10 amazing and unique things to do in Ocho Rios, Jamaica. Jamaica is all in all one of my all time favorite places to visit on the top of my bucket list and I cannot wait for you guys to experience it. So here are the 10 amazing and unique things to do in Ocho Rios, Jamaica. Number one on the list is by far the most famous destination or spot in Jamaica. It's one of Jamaica's most photographed attractions. It's Dunn's River Falls. Dunn's River Falls encompasses 180 meters of terraced cascades. With the help of a guide, you can climb up the limestone tiers to the top of the falls, slide down the smooth sections of rock, and swim in the cool lagoons at the base. Cruise ship crowds flock here when the ships are near its port, so it's best to time your visit around them. Bring a camera and wear water shoes. Please wear water shoes, highly recommended. And appropriate clothing, as chances are you'll come back soaked. Number two on the list, the Blue Hole. Typically less crowded than Dunn's River Falls, the alluring blue hole, also known as the Irie blue hole, is a series of picturesque jungle pools fed by waterfalls in the lush mountains, about a 25 minute drive from Ocho Rios, also called Island Gully Falls or the Secret Falls. This used to be off the main tourist track, but in recent years, it's become more popular. Several levels offer different vantage points, but the higher you climb, the less people you'll probably encounter. One of the most popular things to do here is clamber over the slick rocks above the pool, where you can play Tarzan on a rope swing and jump off into the turquoise water. Guides are recommended for safety. They'll show you the best places to swim and cross the river. But if you don't want to swim in the pools, you can visit the area on your own. It's also a good idea to wear water shoes as well, as the rocks can be slippery. Next on the list is Mystic Mountain. If you're looking for a tropical adrenaline rush, Rainforest Adventures Mystic Mountain should be on your must-do list. This popular tourist attraction offers several different types of adventures. Start by ascending the mountain on the Sky Explorer, a chair lift perch high over the rainforest. At the top, you can enjoy breathtaking views of the cruise ship port and coastline below. From here, you can zoom down the mountain on the bobsled, a single person roller coaster ride, or fly through the rainforest canopy on the zip lines. Guided rainforest walks, a rope course, climbing wall, ragamuffin thrill ride, and an infinity pool with a water slide round all of the fun here. You can even ride electric ATVs. Not sure which activity to choose? You can combine several of the attractions in a variety of packages depending on your interests. Number four on the list is Dolphin's Cove. Across the road from Duns River Falls in Ocho Rios, popular Dolphin's Cove is a marine park offering up close critter encounters. The five acre property encompasses a natural cove where you can snorkel with stingrays or paddle around the glass bottom kayak, surrounded by rainforest. Absolutely beautiful. The dolphin encounters are the highlight here. Each visitor scores plenty of time with these gentle creatures, including the chance to hold and feed the dolphins, as well as swim with them and enjoy the dolphin kiss. <laughs> you can also ride a camel, 
watch a shark show, and see iguanas, snakes, and tropical birds on the Jungle Trail walk. Photos of your experience are available for an extra fee, of course. Ocho Rio Bay. Craving some sun, sand, and sea? Stake a spot on the well-groomed sands of Ocho Rios Bay Beach. Packed with activities and amenities, this buzzing stretch of coast might not be the peaceful picture-perfect beach of your dreams, but it's a great place to sign up for some water sports, action, or kick back on a sun lounger and do some people watching. If you're looking for things to do in Ocho Rios Port, this popular stretch of coast is only a two minute walk away. You can see the cruise ships looming offshore. Wondering about places to eat in Ocho Rios? You'll find plenty of restaurants lining the stretch. And if you're up for something more active, you can book banana boat rides, tubing, parasailing, and snorkeling equipment at huts along the beach. Next on the list, Firefly. On the site of a former lookout for the pirate Henry Morgan, Firefly is the hilltop home and final resting place of playwright Sir Noel Coward. The simple one bedroom home was built high on a hill above Coward's original home, Blue Harbor, and his photos, paintings, and pianos are still in place. You can see the home on a guided tour and learn about Coward's life, as well as some of Henry Morgan's infamous history. But the highlight here is the spectacular view of the Jamaican coast from one of the best vantage points on the entire island. Green Grotto Cave. About 30 minutes drive from Ocho Rios in Runaway Bay, the Green Grotto Caves are Jamaica's best known limestone caves. They were once used by Arawak Indians and were also the reputed hideaway of escaped slaves and Spanish settlers fleeing from the British. In more recent years, they were also used as a backdrop for a Bond movie. Today, they are home to bats and snakes. Guided tours share the history of the caves and show you the beautiful stalagmites as well as an underground lake. The slippery paths and many stairs might be a challenge for those with physical disabilities. Also, I recommend bringing water shoes. River tubing on the White River. At the White River, about 30 minutes drive from Ocho Rios, Nature lovers can relax on inner tubes and drift along the crystal clear river over gentle rapids. This is a soothing trip that the whole family can enjoy, and it's a great way to unwind and enjoy the tropical scenery. Singing guides add to the fun, and birders will enjoy looking for new species in the lush foliage fringing the river. The Ocho Rios White River Valley Tubing Safari is a fun way to get a taste of floating down the river. This 90 minute adventure includes a round trip transportation from your hotel, experience guides, and a safety briefing, and also refreshments. Kanoko Falls and Park offers a peaceful slice of nature and plenty of family-friendly attractions. Enjoy a guided stroll through the lush botanical gardens, bursting with tropical blooms and dotted with koi ponds and cool streams. The tours include a stoop in the small museum where you can soak up some Jamaican history and learn all about the area's original inhabitants, the Taino Indians. Ooh, little girl. Kids and adults alike will love the mini zoo with many species of endemic and exotic birds. 
but the highlight here is the rocky ledges and the waterfall for a fun photo op. Don't forget to bring your water shoes and camera. Last but not least, Shaw Park Gardens. High in the hills overlooking Ocho Rios and the Caribbean, Shaw Park Gardens is a sanctuary for nature lovers. Within the 25 acre grounds, you can stroll through lush botanical gardens punctuated by tropical blooms and lily top ponds. Many species of birds flit through the trees, including Jamaica's national bird, the doctor bird, also called the swallow-tailed hummingbird. A waterfall cascades through the gardens and friendly guides share their knowledge of all the botanical beauties. You have made it to the end of the video, yay! Don't forget to comment the Jamaican flag. If you're going to Jamaica, kudos, hats off to you. I honestly hope you have the most amazing time there. And if you've been to Jamaica and there's any tips that you can drop, any gems that you can drop, please do not forget to comment down below. It helps more than you know. I really appreciate everyone for sticking till the end of the video. And again, we are almost to 500 subscribers. You guys are not playing and I love it. Thank you guys so much for all of the support. To continue supporting this channel, please do not forget to like this video if it helped. Comment down below if you have any tips that I've missed or if you just like the video and also don't forget to subscribe and become a part of the family so you don't miss another Travel Tuesday. Well, until next time, have safe travels out there and I'll see you next Tuesday. Bye.